Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics and we are going to look at another method from the random library, the random module. So let's just jump into it. <clears throat> the one we're going to do is choice and it's a pretty cool one. So let's just go at it. So we just want choice, we're not going to touch the whole library from random import let's move this down just a little bit import choice so new equals list but before we get into it I just want to make sure that everybody is aware that we have videos every day and I don't want you missing anything because these are going to start really building on each other. So, all right. Oh, I want 1 through 10. So, what did I do wrong? That needs to be 11. Okay. So, new. Okay. So, there we go. All right. So, let's go through for i in. Let's do this three times. Range 3. Close it out. Uh, and it's just choice. And actually before we get into it <clears throat> let's pull it up so okay sequence and then you drop in the sequence or the iterable and it's gonna spit one out so <clears throat> choice new we're gonna do this three times so print Oops, that was sloppy. Sorry, guys. New. Close that out. Okay, run this. Lo and behold, so what this is doing is it's randomly going through. It's using the random and going, looking in <clears throat> to the sequence and then spitting out the numbers. So if we were to make this, what, let's just say 20. So it's randomly just going to continue to kick out numbers. And as you can see, it has 10 twice. Let's see, two, uh, I think four times. So this is a very awesome, awesome method from random. And I wanted to make sure that you knew about it, knew how to use it, and knew where it was. So. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to click that like and subscribe button. And most important, that notification bell. And please leave any comments, questions, or my absolute favorite, any video requests below. Thanks, guys. We'll see you next time.